Well, will you look at that? I'm back. We're about to walk into this cave, which I left myself in a cliffhanger. Half my team is dead, and I don't know what to do. But anyway, let's keep going. I don't know what's in front. Ice. 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 Team Plasma Guy. The giant chasm. This is the spot where Kiram's powers resonate. Here, Kiram can use the full extent of his power and easily cover the, all of Unova and Ice. Boom. Kiram, come. Nice animation. Haran. I have a memory that has continued to haunt me. Just one. That unpleasant look in your eyes reminds me of it. That aside, this is a gift to you for sh to show my respect for making it this far. I'll freeze you solid right here so you can watch my glorious descent. Do it. Kiram. Glaciate. Hurrah! I'm going to be frozen! Yes. Finally, the main character is about to die. <laughs> okay, that's awesome. Sekrom, fusion... Ah, dang it. I was about to die. So you came. The freak without a human heart, N. N, yes. Sekrom told me Kira is suffering suffering. I can't allow selfish humans to make Pokemon suffer. And I like Unova. It's the place that taught me how to live as a human. It's the place that made me notice the harmony between Pokemon and humans living together. I will protect the Pokemon and humans who live here. Bozarash. Excellent. That was a moving expression of your determination. So the education I provided to make you king wasn't a complete waste then. But I still haven't forgotten that even though I was kind enough to find you when you were living in a forest with Pokemon and take you in and care for you, in the end that you were selfish and in the end you were selfish and disrupted my plans. I was supposed to use your abilities to rule Unova. Awesome. But I'll forgive you for that as well. Zekrom, which you were kind enough to bring with you, can shatter rice. Now that you saved me the work for searching for it, well, actually, I knew you'd appear if you would fire ice missiles into a pollution city and you noticed a change. That's an ugly formula. It won't work. Oh, but it will. If I use these. The DNA splicers. Oh, yes. Finally, stuff is about to happen. This gameplay, this playthrough has become way more interesting now. Because stuff is actually happening. What? It's... it's a triangle. It's... it's... Oh, okay. What the crap is going on? Yes! Yes animation! Awesome! I don't know... Top 10 anime fights. Shooting the crap out of him, oh my god. What? Yes, get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Whoa, he got him. Awesome. Combine your powers. And you became a ball. What? Sekrom? Kiram, absorb Sekrom. Use Abofusion. Absofusion. Yes. Combine your strength and become... What? The thing from the box art. And we got ourselves a transforming Kiram. And he will become... Enward Kiram. Nice. Nice 3DS anime... Uh, not the... 
DSI and uh, DS animation. Yes. Wow, they went all out with this one. Rawr. I never would have believed that Pokemon could fuse together. That there was a formula like this. You fool. Last time I was going to use you to capture people's hearts and minds to rule them. But this time I'm simply going to use overwhelming power and rule with an iron fist. Do you understand? If you had simply become king, Unova would have remained beautiful. Come now, trainer. This time no one will save you. But to make things interesting, I'll give you a chance. Let's see if you can stop this hero. What's this? Your Pokeballs are trembling. Could your Pokemon be shaking with rage? No, that's not possible. Simple tools don't have emotion or thought. Come, challenge Kiram. Just so you know, catching is impossible. My cane emits a s signal that disrupts the fu- Really? Why well, I'm gonna have to try that. Whoa. It's only level 55. What the crap? Trick. Well, you know what to do. Haha, <laughs> 44 of these. Dang it. Okay. Looks like I can't catch it, so I have to beat it up. It does. Wow, it doesn't affect me. Cool. I'm actually about to destroy it. Alright, let's play and burst it. And let's hex it. Not before it uses an electric move that might actually kill me. Never mind, it didn't kill me. Kieran fainted. I literally just 1v1'd it with Light the Way. But, uh... Haran. They were separated. I can't believe it. The black here and I went to all that trouble to preparing. How irritating. Now I have to go recapture Kiram, don't I? But first, I'll take you down... I'll take down disgusting... Yeah. Look at that. I have to battle. And half my team is dead. Now I hope to God my team is revived. Oh god, he's got a team of six. Ah, uh, he looks tired. And let's send out our lamp. Okay, good. My whole team is revived. Okay, so I'm going to hex it. Because it's a ghost type. And ghost types are strong against ghost types. And... I was poisoned, but that's okay. Huh, <laughs> okay. He's got leftovers. I was expecting exactly that kind of move. Okay. That, that kind of move? A full restore, you cheap little shit? Alright, so... Alright, cool. So he's recovering his health, he's gonna use another full restore because these trainers are super cheap. Actually, no. This is ridiculous. I can't attack it because he keeps using Protect. Never mind, he's dead. The thing fainted. Alright, cool. And... We got a frog. A toad. I'm sending out cotton candy, because cotton candy will actually do good things. Alright, we got ourselves a seismic toad. Let's use the uh, razor leaf. Because razor leaf actually does things against it. It almost killed it. So it's using flood wave and Alright. Let's use Razor Leaf one more time, I suppose. 
and we got XP. Now I don't know what's strong against this, but I'm switching out to Area 51. Cool. Electra. Let's use Psychic. Oh god, he knows Crunch. Okay, let's hope to god that Psychic actually kills him. No. Well, YOLO. Let's hope that- Ah, uh, dang, I'm dead. That's okay. Let's send out double dip. And let's use... Mirror Shot. Not very effective, huh? That's not good. I'm using Nice Beam. There we go. Electroth died. Who's next? We got ourselves an Electric type. Uh, no, uh, Poison type. Anticipation. Okay, so let's use Mirror Shot one more time. Ah. I think I'm dead here. Yeah. Oh god. Uh YOLO, let's send out Bird up. I'm going to fly. And I hope to god this does any damage. And Okay, it did actually do something. Cool. Dead. And level 57. Hi, dra- Oh god, it's a dragon type. Double dip would do really well here, but you know... I guess not. I'm flying again. Oof, that did pretty bad. That was- that was bad. Okay. And I avoided the attack and attacked you, and let's see how much... Oh, uh, that did almost nothing. I'm dead. Bird up fainted. Now... I'm sending now right the way, and I hope he attacks first. So, let's use Flame Burst. Ah, oh, come on! Why is that thing faster than me? Well, if he keeps using that, he'll eventually die. Wait, what? No, what Pokemon is he even on? Uh, we both have two more. I'm gonna surf it. This won't kill me. Yep. Now you're dead. There we go, you died. And I get XP for that. What the crap is this Drapion? Oh, that thing. And let's surf you. Okay, you're probably not gonna kill me. Oof, what's this? This is nothing like I expected. Now let's see if- yeah. He uses Night Slash, that won't kill me, and I use Surf and I win the battle. Now that went a lot worse than I expected, but you know what? I'll take it, I won. It failed yet again, I couldn't have been to be by some trainer who just started his journey not like a f two months ago. How can this be? I'm the creator of Team Plasma, I'm perfect. I'm the absolute ruler who will change the world, and yeah, I've lost to an unknown trainer not once, but twice. Ha! <laughs> I can't accept this. This is impossible. I can't be bested by fools who can't even use Pokemon correctly. It's hard to call you this, but fodder, please understand, Pokemon are not tools. Pokemon and humans take each other to greater heights. They are wonderful partners. Some humans understand this. Why can't you? Shut your f***ing mouth. Shut up, shut up, shut up. Don't talk to a person, you freak. 
No real person can talk to Pokemon. Or gets it has lost control. We'll take it from here. Okay. Without fire, Team Plasma is... Farewell. Awesome. On behalf of everyone, thank you. Kyurem is fine. Now that it has lost its power, but it will come here again. Yeah. Zekrom says thank you as well. That's right, I can talk with Pokemon. On that day, two years ago, a certain trainer in Alder taught me something. By accepting different ideals, this world creates a chemical reaction. So I met many different Pokemon and people and heard so much. And that's how my world quietly grew bigger. By being a Pokemon humans... By being with Pokemon humans can control toward new horizons. By being with humans, Pokemon can exhibit their true power. That's what Zekrom taught me, the ideal for Pokemon and me. And someday, both ideals and truth will come together. Then Pokemon and humans will be free from the oppression of Pokeballs. You. What are you and your Pokemon striving for? You should head to Pokemon League and put your ideals to the test. Farewell, N word. Ah, damn it. I was about to end the video. Yep, I see, so it's finally over. More importantly, you rescued Kieran from Team Plasma, right? You're really something. I'm gonna make sure Perloin gets him back to my sister. I still I can't take out the Pokeball yet though. What are you gonna do? He said the Pokemon League? That's a good idea. I mean now you're the strongest in Unova, right? Go prove it. Do you remember when we first met up in the Giant Chasm? If you follow your path from there, it goes up to Hunter Route 13. Victory Road and the Pokemon League are just past there. Awesome! So anyway, I'm going to end this here. Do the simple things like like and subscribe. See you all next time!